after the draft combine, scouts were going crazy over Cato. There wasn't one team that wasn't interested in what Cato could do for them. The only thing was who was really going to take the chance on him first. Again, there is a lot of talent in this year's draft, so it will be interesting to see how things go. But before we can even get into the draft, Cato was looking to get his driver's license so he could get that car you guys suggested. Okay, you are, let me assume here, Kato Rizal James. <laughs> all right, awesome name, bro. All right, I'm going to be your driver instructor today. We're going to have a lot of fun, all right? I'm going to make this as easy as possible for you. It should be no sweat, all right? Pretty simple, all right? So all we're going to do is just going to be simple, all right? We're going to spin the block, and then we're, we're just going to come back. I'm going to grade you on parking and all of that stuff, all right? You ready? Don't be nervous, Kato. Let's do it. See what I tell you. This is going to be pretty easy. All right. Watch the oncoming traffic. Yep. All right. Hit this right right here. All right. And then we're going to hit this alleyway. All right. And you just park it right here. All right. So, Kato, I just need you to sit tight for a second. I hadn't gotten to eat lunch yet. So, I'm going to run in the strip club, get some chicken wings, and uh, I'll be right back. All right. Hey, guys. What's good? What, what's good? What's the word? Yeah, man. I don't know. I don't know. I mean, I got what you need, but do you really need it? I mean, price is getting kind of high, so either you can pass or you can muscle up. I mean, I can't budge off my prices, all right? My prices are my prices. No, oh, 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 is that how you feel? Well, f you then, bitch ass nigga. Oh my god. Nah, that's on my mama, bitch ass boy. Sorry, Kato. You just want to slowly turn out, all right? Back up just a little bit, and then we're going to go ahead and get out of here, okay? Tell Jay Quan I said, f you get drive, they don't drive! Damn, Nick, don't swerve, drive! Oh, them niggas shoot back! Oh, they shoot back, Kato! Spin the block, Kato! Spin the block! Luckily, Kato barely passed, but let's be honest that teacher was wildin and now for the most important part the actual draft and although kato was nervous he was confident that he was going to go top five he had done the work needed and he knew the outcome would be great for him no matter what pick he was and then it happened wait 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 before we reveal the draft pick kato needs your help again all right it was time for lacrosse to pay up but kato had to make a decision between two cars so what do you guys think lacrosse is about to have to drop a mean bag on one of these cars because let's be honest kato is over seven feet tall and the cars have to be customized to fit kato so he wants to make the best decision possible and you guys definitely can help with that so what are we gonna go with? Are we gonna go with that Bentayga? You know what I mean? Or are we gonna go with the Mercedes AMG? So you guys let me know which car, what color, and why. So as you might have seen in the intro, Kato actually did not go number one overall. That went to Paolo Banchero. The Houston Rockets decided to go with the 16, 250 pound small forward, power forward combo. That boy is dumb athletic. And unfortunately, the second pick in the NBA draft goes to Chet Holmgren. Detroit decided to go with Chet because Kato honestly did not want to be a part of the Detroit Pistons organization. Like I said in the last episode, make sure you guys go check that out. If you missed that episode, obviously, if he wasn't going to play in Houston, then that means the next Texas team was going to pick him up in the San Antonio Spurs. That boy Kato is now a spur at the number three overall pick in the nba draft and right now i'm going to show you guys the rest of the draft you guys can pause it if you need to see who all got drafted who all made it in and this was a great draft man some of those players you might recognize from the draft combine but there are some amazing players in this year's draft i cannot wait to see how chet muscles up in detroit along with kate cunningham 
him that's going to be amazing to see and uh yeah i hope you guys are just as excited as i am for this season because it's about to be amazing but before we can get into the regular season we do have to play some summer league basketball and i'm going to show you guys the summer league team that san antonio somehow managed to to bring a, i don't know bro but y'all see what the lineup is looking like and jabari parker somehow finds his way onto this san antonio's first summer league team we got kato we got an anta katumpo brother oh man this is gonna be fun but we got our first matchup against the charlotte hornets summer league team unfortunately jello was not there you know who was there james boat knight and yeah i'll just let y'all i'm gonna just leave it at that <laughs> so without further to do let's go and get into today's game poppy got it chat sing it with me for the summer league jump on get on lord and i cannot lie bro i just realized we were going up against the charlotte hornets huge missed opportunity to put jello in the lineup but guys this won't be the last and final series on this channel i got y'all next time and maybe just maybe we'll see charlotte in the finals or something and i can add them there but hey get it do that rim that boy kato summer league debut guys and i, I can't lie a lot of you, some of you guys were smart enough. Y'all was like, you know what, YG? It's only going to make sense for Kato to go to the San Antonio Spurs. And, that, and that's only if you paid attention to the intro. A lot of you guys wanted to see my boy in Houston with that number one pick. And they decided to go a different route. It is what it is. You know what I mean? We're going to make the best of the opportunity that we get. And that opportunity is going to be in San Antonio. Now, some key things that you might have missed in the last episode i'm gonna need y'all to go check that out because san Antonio got a lot of tricks up their sleeve and i can't wait to see wait a minute i cannot believe these boys out here green and cashing me outside there's a lot of mismatches going on in this summer hey wait a minute in this summer league game the score is 24 to 28 hold on baby i'm sorry i did not mean to cuss y'all but kato with the block all the way too weak james don't do that you feel me 24 to 30 right now finding the cutting man i don't know i kind of like this summer league team these boys is actually active right here getting the reboard stepping up to the plate you feel me you you see what i'm trying to do right there but unfortunately san antonio is down by three which means kato bump a hey and won me Which unfortunately means Kato has to step it up. You know what I mean? The, the coaches weren't expecting too much. Especially seeing as how he's going to get restricted minutes. Now, number three overall pick. They not looking for my boy to go out there and get injured. Y'all should know how that goes. But y'all know Kato also loves to hoop, bruh. That's where he finds his peace and his comfort. So that's what he's going to do. He's going to hoop. Even, even if the team is like, hey, Kato, I don't know, man. You know Kato going to be like, nah, I need this. You feel me? Look at Jabari Parker getting a standing dunk. Now, the score currently is 48 to 54. Kato has managed to fight this team back into the game. But like I said, restricted minutes. And Kato gets subbed in. And yeah, 83 to 60 it was a 86 68 is the final score. Kato didn't want to do too much, but he did enough. You feel me? I hope you guys did enjoy this video man if you did make sure you guys leave it a thumbs up subscribe turn on post notifications if you are new to the channel and you want to see some more nba 2k content just like this and i got you guys but until the next one man peace got some of the best players in the draft as you see my boy kato in another three oh we bars chad Holmgren, what you trying to do with your boy you know what i'm saying kato to win overseas and got real strong give me that Call me Christopher Brown. You feel me? I need that board as well. Come on. Yo. 